نور الجديد عندك انت سلام لاباس عليكم كلشي مزيان Uh, oh, I thought that I um I would the whole thing. So I said Snul Jadid and Kum Tuma. What's the new like uh, like uh, that you have to? Salam, uh, Salam Don, Salam uh, Sizlak, uh, Salam Alison, Salam Branda, Jermai, Evasalik Jermai. We missed you. Um, nah, salam, la basedi, salam, sam, kulkum la bas, kulshim zian. He doesn't have kum. So, this is uh, like a very important sentence that we all as Moroccans say when we meet our friends or someone we haven't uh, seen in a while or a few hours. <laughs> Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Jeremiah. You okay now? I'm so sorry to hear that. I hope that you're doing well. Yeah, I, I hope that you're doing good. I'm sorry to hear that. Like I did notice I was always asking uh, about you and Brian because he, he, we missed him like for a little while as well. Thank you, Hussein. That's really nice of you to say. Thank you. Yes, so... Um, Kidal's Nharkum. So this is, how was your day? This is plural. Kidal's Nharkum. Kidal's is like how you spent or how your day passed. Kidez is like how fast. Kidez. Nharkum is like your day. Nharak is your day, but singular. Nhari does easy, alhamdulillah. Salam Shivam. Alhamdulillah. So because we are on a night time right now, I think um, most in most of countries it's night time right now, right? And um non harikan zian hamdulilla. Iwa don iwa iwa shnuka ta awada don kain she said it if there is any new news Salam Don Peter Minta for all the new members with us, all people who are with us here for the first time. Welcome to my live. My name is Kautar. Marlene name is Kautar. Uh, but you can call me Katie. This is, I think, is easier for most of people and uh, easy to remember as well. And uh, I'm teaching Jaliza. We have like uh, two lives live in the morning. It's called the morning tea, uh, tea talk where we talk about the culture, relationship, uh, language, and I answer all the questions that you might have. I give you insights from inside of Morocco. And uh, basically, this live is um, like a short language short um, kind of live. I give lessons, I uh, answer questions concerning language. And every day we have a different topic. Yesterday, we had a topic on the breakups, some breakup sentences. And as I said before, we've done like a lesson on um, uh, how to order on the coffee. So we uh, decided to do today a uh, lesson about vocabularies, about vegetables and uh, fruits in the region. Okay, let me see. Uh, it was nice to see. Alhamdulillah, Mzian. Salam. <laughs> what happened? What happened, uh, Joanna? Who you have tried the conversation with? 
Um, did you try the sentence I gave you in the morning? Is this is what I what you mean? The sentence I gave in the morning. Did he answer? Alhamdulillah, Don. Dominic, did you eat shibakia? Yes, Joanna, yes. Yes, um, it's like, it's just the beginning is in everything, in uh, businesses, in languages, in a relationship. Everything at the beginning is hard, but step by step, you discover more and more and more, you learn more. So in all like things in life, everything basically, not just the language. Salam Christian, la basalik, kidair. No, his brother might be AFF talking English with me. I'm trying to chat with his brother who does not speak English. Oh, yes. Uh, yes, it's good that you try to do that. But probably he's going to talk with his friend, with his brother first and tell him, should I answer? What should I say? That's what will happen. Alhamdulillah. <laughs> Alhamdulillah. Ala wajib. So yeah, before we start, do you have any question concerning the language? Uh, of course, uh, because the night we do about sentences, about um, vocabularies. Uh, what is uh, your level so far with the people who are new with us? For people who already have been here, did you have any question concerning pronunciation, concerning some uh, notes that you might be taken, but you forgot to, to, to write the translation? Oh, yeah, ala wajib, it means uh, you're welcome, but actually the literal meaning is like, it's my job. So we have a different way to say thank you, and this is one of them. So ala wajib, it's literally mean like on my job. So as a teacher, whenever like a student tell me thank you, I say ala wajib because it's my job to um, answer question. It's my job to clarify and explain. And it's mean you're welcome. Blanca, salam Blanca. <laughs> so yeah, there is different ways. It can laugh. Uh, it's kind of like pleasure. What else we have? Laugh. Uh, Hanya. It means like uh, no worries. Hanya. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, and Tina be fair. Shukru lila, shukru lila. Okay, so for people who are like who are new with us, I know you might find uh, some things difficult. You might find some words that the, the, in the comment section that is not understandable. But no worries, uh, there are already like many videos that. Um, they're going to help you have an insight, try to make sure to go back to the videos and watch them, uh, write notes and practice them whenever you're free. And also for people who are with us in the comment section, for example, Shivam, Blanca, who write like, certain things in uh, Darija, please try uh, to put equal and write the meaning in English so that the other ones going to um, see the meaning and take notes while I'm teaching something else so it's going to be everyone like learning and uh, you know the new and the old okay so yeah as i said like we're going to do fruits and vegetables we're going to start with uh vegetables and the first word we're going to talk with like uh, to uh, start with is carrots carrots carrot is in Darija, Khizo. Khizo. So if you're going to go to the Medina, if someone already went to Morocco, they know what Medina is. So the um, traditional section when you 
uh, they have like a lot of vegetables and you might find that like uh, organic uh, natural one and it's like cheaper. So you would tell him, for example, اعطيني, give me, and we talked a lot about, about اعطيني, اعطيني kilo خزو, give me one kilo of uh, carrots, okay? So this is how you would order. So we're going to do vocabularies and putting them in sentences and practice them, okay? اعطيني kilo خزو. Atini kilo tresso. Atini kilo. Try to practice at the same time as I'm practicing. Atini kilo de tresso. End of uh, the the live. You couldn't see me or hear me. Uh, write me in the comment section because I will be able to see your comments. Okay? Because I know today I've been like teaching a few hours ago and uh, the Wi-Fi was acting funny. So yeah, <laughs> so yes, chizo, chizo. So pronunciation, widen your mouth when you say it. Chizo, chizo, chi, chi, chizo. Okay, atini, atini. This is why we we sound like so happy when we talk. Uh, even when we talk loud, actually, we talk very loud, and we say atini, atini, atini kilo chizo, atini, atini kilo chizo. And if you notice the kilo, like one kilo is like almost like two pounds, I guess. Uh, you we combine kilo with the. Yes. Uh, so make a jibnish chizzo. Yes. Bsah blanka make a jibnish chizzo. Yes, uh, Kevin. Uh, the Wi-Fi at night is very um, is very slow. Uh, it, in the morning is great if you watch my lives on the morning is perfect uh, during the night everyone is connected so it acts in a certain way <laughs> okay and that can you give me uh can you give me so cauliflower Uh, Brenda, every morning at 8.30 Moroccan time, but it's like my lives are from Monday to Friday. So tomorrow is like Saturday, so I'm not going to be live. Um, I don't be live the weekends. I used to, but I try to, the weekend to create something, some new contents. So, yeah. But... Okay. But not as in uh, the USA, not like America. Hello, Branka. You you very welcome. Hello, Wajib. So yeah. So I said cauliflower is called shiflor. Cali. I don't know how to write it in English. I forgot the spelling. I think it's like cauliflower. Something like this or cauliflower. <laughs> don't remember if it was like with a or o. I think I wrote it right. She floor. She floor. So we, you have to emphasize the sh, she, she, she floor. She floor. Salam ala, marhaba khoya. Marhaba khoya. Yeah, I, I do talk with the wood. I talk with, yes. Yeah, I thought so. There is something missing. I was like, something is missing there. Thank you, Sam. Um, Ala, you welcome over here. I know you want to learn English. We talk both languages here. <laughs> yeah. So, yes, she floor. She, she floor. So, you really have to emphasize it. For example, to say, I like uh, cauliflower, so you'd say, Kaya jibni, Kaya jibni she floor. Kaya jibni she floor. Okay. كيعجبني شي فلور اوكي try to pronounce after me كيعجبني شي فلور كيعجبني شي فلور كيعجبني شي فلور منين تعالى من اين مدينة
So potatoes is pata. B -b pata. 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 For example, if you want to uh, order, like, uh, take like a half kilo of potatoes, you would say, أعطيني نص kilo. So نص is half. Kilo is like a kilo. Nus kilo. De tata. Okay. Atini nus kilo de tata. Atini nus kilo de tata. Okay. Atini. مرحبا أخويا بناس جديدة. I never um, talked with someone from Jadida. مرحبا بك اخويا اوكي اعطيني نص كيلو دبطاطا اعطيني نص كيلو دبطاطا اوكي سو يو نو ذا جرين بيبر لايك ذا سويت وان ذا بيبرز بيبرز اتس كول فلفلا فلفلا تريد بليز تيك نوتس تيك نوتس فلفلا Okay. To say like green one is fifla khadra. Okay. Hi Alex. Um yeah, I'm looking forward to having you as a student with us as a family over here. And um, yes, if you are an absolute beginner, make sure sometimes to watch my old videos to have like um, a background ideas and a little bit of uh, information about the region and everything. So yeah, where are you from, Alex? Uh, Joanna. So we will talk about something like feminine, like Tata, it's ending with E. And in one of my lives, I explained uh, how to say Kejibni and Katejibni. So you have to say Katejibni. كتعجبني بطاطا كتعجبني بطاطا كتعجبني بطاطا so كت كتعجبني بطاطا for like the other ones like that is like mask after me I'm going to say it slower I'm just making sure Making sure that you hear me. Hello, it's me. Rabbi, mm -hmm. uh, Um, yes. Uh, I'm sorry, guys. Did you lose me in like in a in a while? Uh, were you able to hear me? I'm just like making sure because I saw that the connection was unstable. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, it's like because I'm here and you all in the other side. So I was like, hello, do you hear me? <laughs> yes, what about now? You hear me well? Yes, uh, yeah, it's like, um, Sometimes it go bad. I don't know if like I should uh, sometimes make the lives earlier, but but I work before that. Um, so yeah. Okay, let me see here. Are you able to hear me? Uh, that's great, Brenda. Sometimes it's like the worst when I like um, uh, the Pirki pear. Uh, the Pirki pear is like sabar and zebul. Um, uh, actually, we call it. So Pirki pear is zebul, 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 zebul. Okay. Z, 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 z is like Z sound. So number three is a, a, a. So Z, 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 Bull, Z, Bull. 
Okay, let me see if I missed something. Yes, thank you. I've watched two of your videos so far for beginners. They are clearly very clear in Dubai. I'm from Brighton in England. Uh, yeah, we call for people from England. I love people from England and also like um, I enjoy talking with some people from England and I enjoy like uh, their way of talking like their English because most of my uh, friends they were from um, from the States. So it's like different accent, but I enjoyed like meeting more people from England. Uh, okay, you could maybe make it live later when the people are using the Wi-Fi. Like later at night. If it's later at night, people will be already asleep. Like, um, you know, people who watch. And um, if I put it earlier, sometimes like uh, I do work from um, six to nine. So I literally like finish the class and I go like straight to the live. Alex, I'm so glad that you found the, the, the videos clear and enjoyable. I'm going to try to make more videos during the weekends. So people can like um, watch them in their free time. Yeah, I'm going to see about this, Pali. Uh, uh, Alison, I'm going to try to think about a certain way so I can like uh, use the Wi-Fi freely. And if I would have any opportunity to uh, maybe get like two Wi-Fi's or something to work freely with that. Yes. So yes, so the last thing we said, Zebul is not like visible, but um, uh, that's it. That's like what it's called. So uh, eggplants, eggplants is called dinjel. 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 Okay. Guli li hum gara. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to get to that. <laughs> yeah, I'm taking it one by one. Um, I'm, I'm I'm having all like the fruits and and they are like in one order. There is the al al hamra and the al khadra. Okay, so yes, I said danjal. For example, kay ajibni danjal. I like a plant. Kay ajibni danjal. So next one is cucumber is lakhiar. 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 So if you notice, like uh, this is just like I'm grinding. So lakhiar. Lakhiar. So we said to my tooth. So this is like a salad that Moroccans do when they are in hurry. Is lakhiar or matisha. Like tomatoes and lakhiar, and they put them as a salad. So this is very famous in Morocco. Lakhiar or matisha. Like something very simple, but still like healthy and good. Lakhiar, lakhiar. Kayajibni lakhiar. I like cucumber. Kayajibni. Kayajibni. Okay? You got the pronunciation. If you found any one of them like hard to pronounce, let me know and I would like try to pronounce it like more clearly. Lakhiar. Okay, we already did Matisha al khiar. So uh, the green beans, the green beans. is called Jilbana. 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 That's it. Jibni. Jilbana. Okay. Okay, give me a minute, guys. That's a jibni jilbana. Jilbana, or so we said so far. Do you have any uh, one of them like hard to? Do you find any of them like hard to pronounce so far? Okay. Do you hear me, guys? If you don't hear me, please let me know because uh, sometimes I talk and I don't say any comments. So, yeah.
Okay, great. So yeah, Sam, yeah, we talked about uh, that before, if you remember. So when uh, something is ending with A, we use كتعجبني. For example, كتعجبني ماتيشا, كتعجبني فلفلا, كتعجبني شي حاجة. If, um, it's like same as any noun. If we have كيعجبني, the verb I like, plus a noun, I like something, and it's like I like plus a noun, right? So if you have like, I like, and plus a noun. So if the noun, I'm going to write in the, the role, if the noun is feminine, what we mean by feminine is a noun ending with A, just A. So A is the only thing for feminine. You would say, كتعجبني. Use كتعجبني. If it's feminine, you will, if it's masculine, you would use كيعجبني. If it's masculine, you would use كيعجبني. And this is the rule. So for example, filfla, filfla is ending with A. So what you're going to use, you're going to use كتعجبني. Because filfla ending with E, it means it's feminine. If I said, for example, um, uh, خزو, خزو, like carrots, is ending with O. So any other vowel or uh, any consonant uh, that's in TN is masculine. Except A, so I would say كيعجبني خيزو. I like this. I'm glad that you're liking it. Now I'm ending with uh, Tamar Bota. Yes, yes, with Tamar Bota. And uh, the male pronouns will have K, yes. That's the K, that's the rule when we have like, uh, I like plus noun. If you have like, I like plus a verb, for example, I like to go, I like to travel, it's always كيعجبني. كيعجبني نسافر, كيعجبني ناكل, كيعجبني الناس, كيعجبني نقرأ. You see? Uh, Hamad has two meaning. Lemon and nurses. Yes, yes, uh, Don. If, if someone told you to Hamad, it's not a compliment. Of course, it's a bad thing. <laughs> it's mean, uh, like, silly, not in a good way. Yes, and Hamad is lemon. Yes. So, okay. Kayajibni al Hamad. Kayajibni al Hamad. So, if you notice, Sam, al Hamad is ending with d, is a consonant, so I put Kayajibni. Kayajibni al Hamad. Atini wahad kilo al Hamad. Like, give me a kilo of, uh, like, uh, lemon. أعطيني واحد الكيلو بالحامل. Okay? <laughs> uh, okay. Um... Did we, uh, so let's now like see the pumpkin, the pumpkin. The pumpkin is the gara, the hamra. So Ayla, you asked about the gara. Here is the gara. <laughs> so pumpkin is the gara, the hamra because it's red. So we say the hamra, the hamra. So the gara, the hamra, the gara, the hamra is one of the vegetables that we put in couscous. It's very important uh, uh, vegetable to put in couscous. We can't eat the couscous because, uh, without the pumpkin because pumpkin is so good in the couscous. Yes. So, So, for example, in the couscous. Okay? Al-Gara al-Hamra benina. Al-Gara al-Hamra is delicious. Let's write this sentence. So, Al-Gara 
Alhamara Benina. So Benina is delicious. Okay, it means pumpkin. Delicious. Yes, yes, yes. It's hard because we have get and that, and then the, the second one is has the ha. I'm going to say it slowly. Uh, just say let's go, let's go. <laughs> yes. Yes, uh, actually, uh, like uh, uh, the seven vegetables that we use in couscous, it should be like all like put together. Like one of them, uh, which is um, carrot. And what is we put? Uh, is like um, uh, the zucchini, zucchini. And what is we do? Uh, not everyone do potatoes, make it rush tata, they don't do tata so they don't do that. Some of them yes. <laughs> don't if you eat a lot of shebekia, if you going to eat a lot of shebekia, you're going to get a lot of cavities in your teeth. Make sure of that. Ah yes, chickpea. Salam Shini Shinai. Do I pronounce your name correct? You're going to hit me. So Shikpi is hummus. Shikpi. I don't know if, if, I, if I'm pronouncing that correct. L hummus. L hummus. So people in the north, they will say hummus. So today I ate couscous with my family. Hummus. Yeah, same as uh, in uh, Spanish, right? I think Spanish they say hummus, something like that. I I think so. I'm not sure. So and hummus. Hummus. Okay, I give me hummus. I don't eat a lot of hummus, but I like it. I like it like to eat it once a while, mara mara, sometimes. Okay, so yeah, uh, let's go back. So uh, when I said pumpkin, it's like the one is hard to pronounce. So I'm going to try to pronounce it like slowly. So try to notice with me the pronunciation. L, 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 gar, l, gar, hamra, l, hamra, l, hamra is the like the red color, like red, like red the uh, pumpkin <laughs> kind of. Lgara l l l g g g l g l g lgara. So if you're going to pro like to practice each uh, consonant by itself, you would find it uh, a bit easy to connect them. Okay. In city coca, drink coca with vegetables or with couscous. I don't. We drink liban. Can you liban? Um, yes. Kat ajbuk kuka? Baba ganoush. What is Baba ganoush done? Yes, so the whole one is going to be Lgra'a Hamra. Ala wajib alisan. So, yes. Uh, Hamra, al hummus, al hummus, or hummus, depending on which place, um, uh, the, um, you know, which place is like, um, it's in Morocco. In the north, they say hummus. So there is like one that's the only vegetable kind of that I don't like. I'm not, I'm not sure if you agree with me, but um, it's the beetroot. It's not like the beetroot. No, no, I do like this one, but the other one. So I'm giving you this, like I forgot the other one. So, yes, how do you say I like lemon sometimes? So, okay, I should name Al Hamad Bed Al Marat. Okay, I should name Al Hamad Bad Marat. I like lemon. Bed Al Marat is sometimes Bed Bed Al Marat. Bed Al Marat. Okay, I should name Al Hamad. بعد المرات اوكي بعد المرات 
And a peach root is called barba. 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 Okay. Apini. Apini. Nus. Kilo. Del. Barba. Apini. Nus. Kilo. Del. Barba. Okay. Let's practice that. Just the word by itself, barba. So notice when also when I use again the b is like always we stretch it. Bedinjan, bedinjan, babagnush. Is the eggplant bedinjan? Babagnush is like another name for it. Oh yeah, yeah. I just like saw you, or yeah, I, I skipped the 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 comments. I haven't seen it, but I saw it now. Yeah, thank you. But uh, is it in English, Baba Ganush? Yes. Okay, so El Barba, Barba, Barba. To get the pronunciation of Moroccans, Barba, Barba, Barba. Katajibni El Barba, Barba, Barba. To get the pronunciation of Moroccans, barba, 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 katajibni el barba. So el barba is ending with a, which means it's feminine. So we have to say kat, kat, katajibni el barba, katajibni el barba. Okay, katajibni el barba. So which one we going to do? Um, yeah, uh, uh, onion is the basla. Onion. El basla. El basla. El basla. Kat ajibni el basla. Kat ajibni el basla. Kat ajibni el basla. Can naakul el basla. Let's use another sentence. Can naakul. Can naakul el basla. Shlada. So I eat onion. In okay, can nakul can nakul. So I eat is like in prison. Can nakul al basla shlada. Can nakul al basla shlada. Okay, uh, blabsla. Yeah, some people don't like onion. I used not to like it when I was younger, but now I like it. But the sweet onion, we, we do have like a sweet onion. Actually, the, the white kind of yellow onion is sweet, but the red onion is not. It's like really strong. I, I can't like stand it or eat. It's like too strong for me. So yes. So even for onion, we do have like red onion and yellow onion. Uh, onion. <laughs> and you would use the... Yes, yeah, same for me. Like I was like so confused. So don't I, I, the, you didn't answer uh, you didn't answer our question. So Baba Ganush, like uh, which language is this? Is Baba Ganush like in certain dialects? Because I already know the Danjal. That's it. So we only call it Danjal. So Ala is a Moroccan guy. So he said like also it's like agreeing with me. Uh, same idea. We say Danjal. Oh, wait, you didn't tell us this. I'm going to look it up on uh, Google as usual whenever I say. Oh, yeah, we don't do that actually. We have, uh, it's called the something else. So it's called Zaluk. <laughs> Yeah, we don't have that name. So it was like a new name for me. I never heard of this. Oh, yeah, yeah of course, we don't. Yeah, yeah really, it was like um, something new. And, and I'm, on, I'm okay with this. I love like um, uh, hearing something new. And I actually do look things up. And I did like right now. It's Baba Ganoush also spelled Baba Ganoush or Baba Ganoush is a Levantine. So it's like from Lebanon. Appetizer, mesh cooked eggplant mixed with tahini, olive oil, 
possibly lemon juice. <laughs> I give all the information already. <laughs> yes. Uh, well, yeah. Yeah, it looks good. Actually, I might try this one day. Kind of like feel hungry right now. Okay. Uh, the thing that we don't have, like, um, uh, the Brussels sprouts is, like, rarely when we see it in Morocco. Uh, I don't know why. So, I think they don't uh, grow it somehow. Yeah, yeah, I saw it uh, done, yes. So, yes, let's get another one. So... We said barbal basla, so garlic is tuma. Tuma. Oh, I wasn't writing. Tuma. Tuma is garlic. Tuma. Tuma. So try like really to emphasize it. Tuma. 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 Okay. Tuma. Tuma. Let's go for something green. So to say lotus is lchos. 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 Okay? Lchos. Atini. Yeah, we're going to deal first with with uh, with vegetables, then we're going to move to fruits. Uh, did you, do you get spring onion in Morocco? Yes, of course we do. I love spring onion. It's like sweet and yeah, the, the long one, right? Yeah, the long one. Yeah, we do have them. They're still called onion basla. Uh, and they actually they call basla khadariya, the, the spring onion. I don't know if they have like one specific name in English, but for us, we call them uh, basla khadariya. <laughs> yes. And it's like it's so good in um, it's like really good when it's it comes to like salads because it's like uh, not like harsh. Are you okay now? Like with the those vegetables, do you have like one that um, is like hard to pronounce? And by the way, broccoli is called broccoli also. We don't have any other name for it. Is just broccoli. The broccoli is bro. In pronunciation, this is why say we say broccoli. Broccoli, okay. Broccoli. Can you give me the broccoli? Give me, give me kilo the broccoli. Give me kilo the broccoli. So there is one that I don't know. Uh, what is uh, so yeah. So the zucchini, did I put the zucchini? Al-gar'a al-khadra. So al-gar'a al-hamra is... Al-gar'a al-khadra. Al-gar'a al-khadra. And uh, by the way, we don't have um, asparagus. We don't have it. And it can be like in like all the... You know, like all the... Like, um, it's fun, like uh, in markets. Okay, yeah, Jibnil Bukhari. Ah, yeah, these are Jilbana. Let's. These are Jilbana. Zilbana. So the other one that I gave, I think I gave a mistake. Hold on. Um, the green bees actually lubia khadra. So zilbana is bees. Uh, green beans, this is how we write them. Lubia. So yeah, that's a correct, like I correct some mistake I did before. I said like a green bees and I said like zilbana. So Jilbana is the piece, yes, Jilbana.
<laughs> no, no, it's like another pronunciation, actually. No, uh, same is not same pronunciation. Uh, and it's, it's like just the half one without the knee, like the bad word. So yeah, jilbana, uh, bees, jilbana, jilbana, jilbana. Green beans as is lubia al khadra, lubia al khadra, lubia al khadra. So zucchini and uh, correct me if I wrote it wrong is al garra khadra, al garra khadra. Oh yeah, Blanca, a lot of words in Darija came from Spanish or English or um, Berber words and uh, some of them from Arabic, so it's a mix of languages kind of. Uh, Yes, yes, um, because you already know in history it was like too close, uh, sp sp like uh, Spanish people were over here, so yeah. Uh, Alex, I'm always live from Monday to Friday in the morning at 8.30 Moroccan time, but uh, yeah, Alex, you said in England, so it's same time, so 8.30 in the morning and uh, 9 30 and 9 so i'm not going to be live during the weekend but i'm going to create a video and leave it on youtube and yes and i see you soon inshallah like take care and good night from arabic yes it's like good it goes good ways so there, there, too many Arabs were in Spanish in the back in the days, like in uh, history, and uh, yeah, same. Yeah, uh, looking forward to see you uh, again, Alex. So there is, is there is any vegetables that I forgot that I didn't mention? Yeah, we have two new friends. So Don and Blanca both speak Spanish. I would see now like a lot of Spanish in uh, in my comment section. I would love that. Okay, yeah, I'm waiting for questions. I'm waiting for some certain vegetables. So yes, I said onion, potatoes, batata, pumpkin, gral hamra. Uh, pepper is uh, filfla, uh, tomato is tomato, uh, peas is jilbana, zucchini is gara al khadra. Ah, yeah, yeah. Um, radish, that's the one that I don't like. So, radish is lifts, lifts, and radish, there are like too many of them. There is the white one that the most that we have actually, uh, the green and the white, so it's like uh, lifts. Lifts, lifts, I'm going to write it down. So, and some of them, the same visual. So I would write visual actually. Lift, gel, sorry, gel. And uh, I don't know, I just like don't like it actually. Like this, gel, gel, gel. Okay, I gel. So I will put different article. I will say me kaya jibnish. Lifjil. Which mean okay. I don't. I'm a slow writer. I'm sorry. Jilbana. Jilbana. It's not jalapeno. Do you talking to me? Like Zilbana. Yeah, um uh, uh, it is translation my Spanish into English maybe No it does not, but I just like uh, I, I like uh, to say like Spanish words and I don't understand them, but I know in a in a point of time I'm going to remember them. 
Yeah, because I'm thinking maybe I would start like learning a, a new language, not a new language, but going back to learn a certain language. So I'm thinking uh, maybe French, maybe Spanish. So yeah. <laughs> yes, Tajib Khezo Jilbana, Obtata. So uh, the, the, my best tagine that I like actually is a tagine, uh, the dish, Moroccan dish is like very famous, so is like with jilbana, which is beef, and batata, potatoes, and khizzo is like um, carrots. And either with meat, either with the uh, chicken, it like tastes so good. I didn't know. Spinach. Sabanich. Spinach is Sabanich. Spinach. Oh, close. Sabanich. 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 Hey, I like Sabanich. I like Spinach. Hey, I like Sabanich with eggs. Like I mix them and I uh, eat them in the morning. Sabanich. How do you eat your spinach? Like, uh, I know, like, because cultures is different and also in cooking. So I would really like to say uh, some certain vegetables, how you eat them. Spinach. 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 <laughs> Yeah, I like tagine ديال الكفته حتى انا كيعجبني كيعجبني الطاجين ديال الكفته كفته is grounded meat so i will write it over here كفته is either grounded meat or grounded grounded chicken so you can say كفته الدجاج or كفته اللحم Okay, to be specific, but kafta is like in general, like a grounded meat in a certain meat. Chris, Christian, you you friends, right? Like from either from friends, I like tagine le marca. Yeah, I like I like everything. <laughs> Mostly, there is like just few things that I don't like. Don't ever mix kifta wilbin. Oh my god, that's disgusting. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> yeah, because kifta is grounded meat and bin is like milky thing. So how it's going to go together? Try it with brie. It's going to be good. It's a Moroccan one. So yeah, sweet potato is tata l'hluwa. Tata l'hluwa. Tata l'hluwa. Sweet potato is l'btata. Btata is tata, is like potato. L'hluwa is the sweet. L'hluwa. L'btata l'hluwa. Tata l'hluwa. Okay? Kat'ijibni bzaaf btata l'hluwa. I like it a lot. Kat'ijibni bzaaf btata l'hluwa. We see blanca b, of course. Like, there's a lot of words from Spanish. Okay? Btata hluwa. Btata hluwa. Btata hluwa. Try it and repeat after me in a sentence. Kat'ijibni btata hluwa. Kat'ijibni btata hluwa. Okay? Kat'ijibni btata hluwa. We're going to go to kabash. 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 I don't know how to pronounce that. Kabash. So actually there is two names of it. Some people they say mkawar, mkawar, and this is what I say. But I do I hear like some people say milfuf, and it depends on the region. So either mkawar, mkawar, or milfuf, milfuf. Kay ajibni mkawar, mkawar. Ah, ta ana blanca kay ajibni bata halwa. Okay, so cabbage is bata. Tata, tata, hello. Sorry, cabbage is in color. Blanca, please answer, Christian. Uh, 
نكور الملفوف جوست لايك غاز لايك تو ايفري وير يس اند ماي فاسكوب كاباش از مكور مكور again with the m m mkor 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 to use the second word is like both of them are understandable so ملفوف ملفوف so if you have any uh, problem with any of them like uh, please let me let me know and uh, let me did i forget any of the I don't know if like I forgot any of uh... yes. For example, I might go for this like because we did check B and uh, like this is this is like that this. Like this, like this, like this, like this. Okay, like this. Like this, like this. Uh, we just like uh, it's corn. We just like use corn for everything. Uh, so basically, I'm just going to say. I'm sorry. Uh, my eyes. Dra, dra, dra. Okay, we don't have any uh, any specific, any other name to it. We just like call it dra. Let me write this for you. That's it. Jibni dra. Dra. D, d, d. Yeah, I didn't send. <laughs> dra. 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 Okay. Dra. Please, guys, if, he, if I missed any of the vegetables, let me know. Uh, this is what came to my mind. And I know there are like too many ones. Like too many. Like uh, not one, not two. And but we try to think of the most important one that like we want, like we want to use and uh, yeah, so uh, there is like one um it's like looks like radish but it's like white. What is it called? I forget the name in English. Is a white one? And it's called actually lifts. Yeah, that's one that I was talking about. It's um, it's calling like lifts, lifts. Let me write this for you. But actually, we have uh, the we have one is tall and one is like no no. So this is like what is it called grass lavia. No, I'm thinking about the one that, if you know like what I'm talking about, the one that it looks like radish, but is white and a bigger. And this one is like, and also, this is again, it's called I know the word gra is like really hard, but just try it like one consonant by consonant. Gra slawia. Gra gr gr gra slawia. Okay. <laughs> my my feet is sleeping. Gra slawia. Okay. So uh, radish, you we don't have it. I never seen it in the market. The one that you wrote down, we don't really have it. Yeah, it's the turnip. Yes, the white radish. Uh, I don't know, like, I, yeah, I, this is what I was looking for. It's like turnip. I don't know it, but it's like uh, really like um, I forgot it. It's called lifts. 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 The, the one that is like rounded. So we have like two of them. And Blanca, yes, I also like I will have to go in a minute. No. 
تهلاي تهلاي فراسك ونشوفك السيمانة الجاية إن شاء الله أوكي so lifts we have both of them we have the round one and we have one of them is like long and it's called the same but I like the long one because it's sweeter and the rounded one is a little bit like have like that butter like taste is a, like a little bit strong but um, yes so uh, both of them for us is like called it's called lifts so we, we have to emphasize the less sound is lifts 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 so you can say okay عجبني lifts or ما كيعجبنيش lifts yeah it's kind of like jikama or whatever but we don't have like literal like uh, jikama is like just uh, the one that we said yeah and that actually is like very healthy even if we don't like it that much so yeah so let me revise with you the vegetables that we have done so far and if i forgot any of them you can tell me yes but we do i'm going yeah so fresh is three three oh i was thinking um three or three it's mean fresh three or three or organic or natural is tabiri or tabiriya if it's a feminine word tabiriya is yes tabiri or tabiriya okay so the quince or whatever you pronounce it like is sfarjal 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 i forgot the n sfarjal 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 as there is red beans we don't have red beans and also i've never seen kale or i never ate kale uh mushroom mushroom is like i forgot it is same as in french uh christian hit me with the mushroom i forgot it in french i uh, forgot it so okra this is we do have even i don't eat it a lot i don't know how to cook it so mlo here so okra is lmlokhia, lmlokhia. Take notes of this. I hope that you are taking notes so that whenever you're going to need to order something or just like to think of it, you would already find it in your notebook. You don't have like to go back, watch the live and look for the word. Of course, you can like uh, watch, re-watch the video to see the pronunciation of all of the words. But at the same time, taking notes is like very helpful for remembering words. So lmlokhia, lmlokhia. Lamrochia. Where did I put Lamrochia? Ah, yeah, yeah. So thank you, Lamrochia. Uh, Salt is Lamlha. Lamlha, 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 and pepper. Is lbzar, lbzar, lbzar or milha, milha, lbzar, lbzar, milha. Okay, salt, milha, 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 lbzar, milha, lbzar. In case we are repeating them, this is the two important uh, spices. We can't cook without them, right? They make everything tasting good. Okay, so uh, we said madnus is uh, parsley. Uh, so the one that I always like was thinking of, like uh, trying to find the word in English. I already like like take notes of it because I always forget it. Is shiva. So for everyone who already in Morocco, did you ever like drink tea with shiva? Um, 
I don't, Jean Warren's like, uh, yeah, we were well, mushroom, we called them Le Charpignon. The second word, I never saw this. Yeah, the se second one, I never like ever, 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 ever. This, this, I don't know. I don't know how to even pronounce that. I never saw this word. So yes, did you ever like drink tea with Shiba with the, the apps and you don't, if you don't have it? So we only drink drink the tea with Shiba in winter time because it warms the body and it helps with uh, making you feel warm and it, it helps with the cold and it's stronger than nana. Nana is a bit have that sweet taste when it comes with the nana with sugar, but Shiba uh, is a bit strong. So how we pronounce it? Shiba. Okay, Brenda. In Spanish, we say champignon. It's like, yeah, same with champignon. The champignon and hongos. No, we don't say hongos. Yes. Brenda, you're, you're from uh, Spain? No. Okay, so verbin. I want to try this one. <laughs> Uh, we mostly we say like I want to taste instead instead of like I want to try. We don't use I want to try. Uh, so yes. Marhbabik um, Branda from Texas. Yeah, the weather in Texas is mostly hot, right? No, no, no. It's not alcohol. Uh, it's like um, how I okay if I. Uh, I don't know how to explain it. It's like nana. So nana is uh, is mint, is green. Shiba is something we put in tea, but is um is like a green, like is a green one. Breton dock, yeah. It's not alcohol because you already know like we don't drink alcohol. And let me see if I can find the proper um... oh my god i didn't see that there is a cajol is like uh, look like that but i just like also like i saw like um like a kind of uh does deep like created it with from it like i have no idea um that's so weird but it's like without the E. The Wi-Fi is so slow. So weird. No, no, it's not alcohol for us. Yes. It says alcohol, no, but it's actually like Shiba. So I don't know like what Shiba call in standard Arabic to look it up. But... <laughs> I'm going to try to find this word in English because this is what they give me in. Um... It's so weird that they gave that word. Like, I am so surprised that. Okay, um, if you like, uh, look like Moroccan tea, how the Morocco, uh, the, like, they do like Moroccan tea, you might find like mint which is like very famous at the same time there is like um no ones yes <laughs> i was like so surprised honestly because um i am looking for it's like been like it, it took me for so long because i want to know why it's name in english and i finally like somewhere I found this uh, in a book or something like that, and I still can't find the name. It's like no way that no one ever can know what its name. Um, let me see that. Yeah, I think I'm going to get it right now. I'm so stubborn if I, if I want to know something. Let me see, did you find this for me? 
<laughs> I would be so happy. Let me see. Um, Aliha, yeah, I just like saw your message. Aliha, marhaba bik, like you welcome. How can I say, may I take a coffee? Um, you just like, we say like, um, I think like as a order, like to order coffee. So the literal uh, meaning of like uh, your sentence is but it's like literal actually it's like can I take a coffee because when we order we don't know we don't order that way we see like literally gave me that or I want this like literally oh my god you saved me uh you saved me who, who said like the meaning of it Yes, Sam, you're great. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, that's what's called actually, yes. Um, and I've been like looking for the name of it because I didn't know like what's name in English. So yes, so Shiba is this. How did you know? Do you have it? Do, does anyone use it in a, in a certain way? Do you drink it in your uh, drinks or something like that? Like for people from Spain, from States, from England, do you ever use it? As I was like looking for it, like uh, try something yet. Like yes, it's called Shiba. Shiba. You emphasize sh. It's Shiba. <laughs> I never heard of this. Yes, that's the thing. So when I was like looking online, and uh, I didn't know the the noun in English, and I was like uh, looking for the the plants. No, no, we're not talking about Shisha. <laughs> we're talking about Shiva. <laughs> Don't you want to smoke some Shisha? Yes, it's a very healthy uh, drink. It's like really good. And I know it's like not uh, every country like uh, drinking it because even like for us, we only like uh, have it in winter time. Mm -hmm. And you wouldn't even like it if it's summertime because it's too strong. But in winter time, it's like really makes you like warm. And uh, also it's like, um, you know, it's like if you are like having a cold or something, it helps a lot. So yeah. Alison, did you like it? I actually liked its smell like, um, I never tried it in my whole life, but uh, our like uh, back in the days, our neighbors they were like always like smoking shisha, and it was always like uh, I smell it in a different uh, smell. Like for example, um, for example, it smells like for example like apple or like some sweet like smell. So it was like I would tell my mom, "Oh, that smells good," and she would be like, "That's disgusting. That's shisha. Don't ever try it." <laughs> I'll be like, I swear I want. Yeah, you would only like like it in when like winter time in when it's cold. But I don't know, it's like just my opinion. Uh, in like uh, when it's like um, summertime, it's like really strong. Oh my gosh, we already set, uh, we already passed one hour. I should like go to sleep <laughs> probably. I actually, I'm, I'm so straightforward with my family. So whenever like me and my mom and dad or whoever in family like having like a certain talk, talk like um, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm asking them right, right away, that smelled good. <laughs> they will be like, what? <laughs> and it's so funny. What about the fruits? Uh, I don't know if we did the fruits, probably we're not going to finish to 11. And I still have to work uh, to wake up early. We don't have a night tomorrow, but I still have to wake up early because I would have like a lesson to give later. 
like tomorrow night. Maybe I would like give tomorrow night. I don't even know like how many classes I have tomorrow. I have to check that. Uh, fruits like are really easy in pronunciation actually. Uh, vegetables there are too many and fruits we don't have too many like for example the, the fruits that they are in um, in Australia or uh, some places we don't have them but we have the most common ones and it's not uh, like um, for example most of them seem as in English for example orange uh, like lemon as lemon um, uh, what is ananas is ananas, avoca is avoca, um, what is kiwi is kiwi. So most of like uh, fruits are the same as in English uh, or in French. So except for example, like uh, apple is fat, that is like slightly different. So we would have like just a like, few of them, not too many. على التوح انا انا بالنسبه لي ما كتعجبنيش ولكن ملي كنت صغيره كنا كنت كنشم الريحه ديال الجيران كانوا عندنا شي ولاد جيران كي كمي وقت كتشم بحال شكل الريحه ديال التفاح الريحه ديال الفريز نعم ولكن حنا مثلا علي بالي ماشي من ماشي من المغرب عمتي شي دارجه كان قرر الدارجة داك الشيء علاش تيعرفوا يهضروا بالدارجة يا ام غوين تو تراي تو فينيش نيكست تايم اند وي تراي مور سنتنسز مثلا دازناها مثل تفاح What is this now? I don't understand. 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 Oh yeah, I didn't even notice that I spoke there either. <laughs> yeah, I'm actually like a very fast speaker in real life. And yeah, when I'm teach or like uh, being on live, like I uh, obviously speak slower. I actually, this is how I speak if like I'm um, like just relaxed and all of that. Yes, can I can say too many things in a very late time. <laughs> اه اه على حنت داك الشيء علاش انا دايره هاد اللايف على الاقل بعدا كنا كقري مزيان تيتعلموا دغيا مبكيين دام داس واس واس ا وود يو سي ماي فيفرس فروس اه حتى نتايا يا ام Yeah, I never tried it. I'm only my jerabs. Tarf, يعني البنات ما كي كميوش وما كي شيء يشوش وما كي نفكر شو لكن مهم. Yeah, Shiva knows me very well. When I drink coffee, I speak faster than normal. Joe Sira Mora, مساء الخير. السلام عليكم. لبس عليك. But actually, we are about to finish. Uh, I already have an Instagram. I do have Instagram. It's same, almost same name. So my Instagram is uh, Deja with Katie. Uh, same as my page, my Facebook page, Deja with Katie. I do have a like a group. It's called. Learn, learn the video with Katie. It's more complicated in general speak too fast, no matter how much from your data probably is and you're No, it's just better. Oh. Yes, actually, Moroccan people not only like speak way too fast, 
the uh, the the speak too loud. Okay, we we speak. I don't know. Like everyone speaking too loud. If someone, for example, kay hadro zerba, he speak fast. Kay hadro zerba. Kay hadro zerba. Yeah, for example, Mgarba, Moroccans, Kehadro, Bzirba, they speak too fast. I actually have to go, it's already turned 30, and uh, I'm trying to learn to sleep early and wake up early. So I have um, to force myself to sleep as usual. Uh, of course, uh, yeah, the Wi Fi, do you hear me now? So yeah, of course the Wi-Fi it gets like so bad in um, when it's like nighttime. Maybe like in midnight it's going to be beautiful, perfect, but I will be like sleeping then. <laughs> I'll try. So yeah, uh, it was like really good seeing all of you over here. Do you hear me? You still hear me? Ah, yeah. Okay, and um, I'm really happy. I love you all, and uh, it's like it's amazing. I'm always having fun teaching you during the morning, during the nights, um, during the week. It's like really amazing, and I'm looking forward to see you again uh, Monday, inshallah. And we're going to finish with the fruits, revising that and putting it in a sentences, talking about how to say some words about cooking so that we can finish with the food and all of that and restaurants. So we're going to practice that more. So it's not going to be just like vocabulary to learn or to write down in your notebook. Uh, we, want to be, we want it to be like more than that. So yes, for everyone who's interested in... Um, one-on-one -on -one lessons, I am still doing that. If you are interested, contact me through my Gmail. If you don't have it, is uh, I don't always like writing it, like TT Roses, that is um, .com. Yes, so, uh, and also, I also like wrote my, uh, my Gmail uh, because if you are interested, uh, I already created like a Darija group, like a WhatsApp Darija group. So you can send me your number and I can add you. It's like a free one. It's like for the members, for everyone over here to help each other and to speak with each other. And whenever I'm free, I'm going to get in there and help you sending me some records. Uh, also, I'm going to create, inshallah, a paid uh, WhatsApp group. But it's not going to be expensive. It's going to be like a monthly paid. But I'm going to be teaching one hour, like three hours a week. For example, it's going to be Monday, uh, Wednesday, and um, and Friday. Hadak uh, Gmail diary. It's my Gmail. Gmail diary. The people who want to learn something. Okay. So yes, thank you so much for being here. Looking forward to see you next week. And if you have any questions concerning anything, language, uh, my online lessons, uh, concerning the WhatsApp, the free one or the paid one, you can contact me through my JWIN and I'm going to try my best to contact to reply to you on time. And i uh, see you next one. Salamaw, tala friyuskom. Or Bye-bye. Subhola khair. Good night. I'm going to say it in French. Bonne nuit. I don't know how to say it in Spanish. I forgot. I learned languages and I forgot them. And I have to, re <laughs> yeah, to remember. Uh, you're very welcome, uh, Sam. Bislam Alik. Shukran. Welcome. Bislam Brandat. Halay Frasa. Bislam Ala. Yes. Bionas uh, notches, yes. Bionas notches. I, adios, yes, yes, yes. That's a good one. Bionas notches, adios. Am I pronouncing it right? 
Amazuk. Yes, one week. Good night. Salaam for you. Come and I see you next time.